<laughs> Hello everyone, this is the Queen Tarot and I am here to do a reading for Leo. Leo, this is your monthly reading for August 2022. So this is for August the 1st to the 15th, 2022. So Leo, please keep, keep in mind that the reading, it may or may not resonate with you. Some parts of the reading might resonate, other parts of the reading might not. As well, keep in mind that, um, I don't know why, but I was going to say, keep in mind that karma is fluid. <laughs> oh my goodness. Keep in mind that time is fluid. This reading can manifest the first half of August. It can manifest later on down the line in time. Or Leo, this present reading could be past energy for you. If this present reading is past energy for you, then there might be answers or closure for you in this present reading. Pertaining to your past situation or circumstance. <laughs> so, Leo, um, I didn't really get messages during the pre-shuffle, but I did get messages. Leo, all I can say was, Leo, what the hell is going on? That's all I'm going to say. What the hell is going on? Leo, I don't know if somebody going to get into a fight. I don't know if this could be a brawl. I don't know what in the world, what energy, what type of energy um, I was picking up on. This could also be like a drug bust, a drug sting. But whatever this is, if it's like a drug bust or something, it's a lot of people that's going to get arrested. Or it's like a whole bunch of people that like might pass away at one time. It's, it's like something um, like a, what do you call it? A catastrophe, a tragedy, something like that. It's like a group of people. Like at one time, they could be going to jail or somebody like a, somebody might pass away, but it's going to be a, a lot of people at one time. So I don't know if this is a building that might explode or something might collapse. But that's, when, when I was doing the pre-shuffle, when I was picking up the energy, all I can say is, what the hell is going on? Leo, what the hell is going on? That's all I can say. So, Leo, I don't know, somebody might be saying that to you. Or, Leo, somebody going to get into a big fight at your house? Leo, if somebody get into a big fight at your house, they going to tear, tear it up. Like, this fight might go from in the house to outside. Or something, something like that going on. But what's Leo overall energy? I'm just going to jump into it. No. What's Leo overall energy? What's crowning Leo the first half of August? Uh-oh. So we got judge in reverse. So Leo, your overall energy, you could be dealing with, you could be operating from your shadow side, Leo. This card came out in reverse. So it say offering only destructive criticism, misusing business, legal or criminal authority. So Jeff, so Leo, I just heard you're not the judge this time around. You could be the criminal or the offender. Or somebody could be accusing you of something, Leo. Or Leo, you're accusing somebody else. This could be true. I don't know if it's true. But Leo, in reverse, this is your shadow side. So, Leo, you could be offending someone. Or, Leo, you could be a, accepting a bribe. You're doing something wrong to someone. Leo, you could be sitting back and turning a blind eye. Somebody could be setting somebody up. I saw that, too. Or, Leo, you're acting like you don't know what's going on, but you do. Or something like that going on, Leo. You operating from your shadow side. Or, Leo, you're picking sides. Offering only destructive criticism, misusing business, legal, or criminal authority. Mm. So, Leo, I don't know what you're doing. Leo, I don't know if you could be bearing false witness. Or you're, what do, what do you call that? Obstruction of justice or... 
when you give authorities false information on purpose, something like that, Leo, you doing? Mm, I don't know. That's probably why I was doing a piece shuffle. I said, what did I say? And I didn't mean to say. Please keep, keep please keep in mind that karma is fluid. Um, but I meant to say timing. <laughs> so Leo, something pertaining to timing. It might be for it, it might be karma. Or Leo, you could be wrongfully trying to give somebody else karma. Something to do with timing. Leo, if you a judge of some sort, whether it's the criminal system. Or you could be like on a panel. You're some type of judge. Leo, you could be um taking a bribe. You took a bribe to like maybe cause an injustice or something, Leo. Something like that going on. But let me get you a let me get you a self-care card, Leo. Give me a self-care for Leo. What's Leo's self-care card? Leo, I pick that energy up a lot when I tap into your energy, like, throughout, like, the year of me just doing monthly readings. Leo, when I tap into your energy sometimes, I pick up that you guys have a tendency to take sides when you should not. Because this energy bringing me back to a reading that I did months ago. It's like, Leo, you took sides when you should not have, or you took the wrong person's side. Whether you did it on purpose or not. Yeah, but your self-care is success. Today or the first half of August is a really good day, time. You're in the flow. Problems are solved quickly and easily. Helpful people show up for you and unexpected gifts fall into your lap. This is your advice. Success. I mean, this is your self-care, Leo, to be a success. Leo, I think spirit wants you to know um, that you don't have to be intimidated. Leo, somebody could be trying to get you to take a bribe. And spirit is telling you you shouldn't or you don't have to because something is successful for you, Leo. This is your self-care card. Spirit wants you to be successful. Like, do what's right and don't take this bribe, Leo, because you don't have to. Today is a really good day. The first half of August is a good time for you, Leo. You're in the flow. Problems are solved quickly and easily. Helpful people show up for you and unexpected gifts fall into your lap. This is self-care. Leo, somebody could be trying to trick you. Or Leo, somebody... Leo, I think... Leo, if you end up in jail or something... It's like, Leo, somebody could be trying to make you snitch and you didn't have to. Because you could have got away if you waited for a lawyer or something. So, Leo, I'm picking up. Don't let, like, authorities intimidate you into saying something, Leo. Uh, lawyer up. Or, or, Leo, somebody might trick you. So, just be careful. Somebody trying to get you to take a bribe. But Leo, somebody could be lying to you. So Leo, I'm going to give an example. Okay, Leo, say like you had a lover and um, your lover, I don't know what your lover was doing. I don't know if your lover is innocent or guilty. But it's like, Leo, the authorities come to you and say, if you don't snitch on your lover, we're going to call child services on you and we're going to take your baby. But Leo, it's something about this situation. Leo, somebody trying to bribe you. Or they trying to trick you. Or somebody wants you to take sides. Leo, somebody could be trying to pay you to do something dirty. Um, but it's like, Leo, you probably don't know this is dirty work. Or somebody trying to be slick. Somebody wants you to do the dirty work for them. But it's like they going to clean it up. But it's dirty work. Or something like that. I'm hearing, Leo, don't take bribes and don't take sides or something like that. Leo, you and your shadow energy. 
And somebody trying to play with you, Leo. Because you operating from your shadow side, Leo. So, Leo, somebody could be also be trying to blackmail you. Leo, if somebody's trying to blackmail you the first half of August, don't don't let somebody blackmail you. Don't do not do this, Leo. Because, Leo, something is successful. This is your, your self-care card. And it say, Spirit wants you to know the first half of August is a really good time for you. You're in the flow. Problems are solved quick and easily. Helpful people show up for you and unexpected gifts fall into your lap. So, Leo, I'm picking up. Lawyer up. Don't be talking to don't be talking to these authorities. Lawyer up. Because something probably not even your fault. Leo, this can even be a car accident. And it's like, Leo, don't admit fault. Don't admit fault. Even if you feel it though, it's the car accident is your fault. Do not admit fault. Because something... Leo, somebody trying to trick you. That judge energy coming out in reverse. Because you be um, judge in reverse. Leo, you operating from your shadow side. And because you're operating from your shadow side, somebody might try to sideswipe you or something. So, Leo, this could be a situation. It's like, Leo, say like you're, a, you're an influencer. Or you like a public figure or you have influence. It's like, Leo, somebody could be like stalking you or something. And they saw you going to the bar and this person is watching you having drinks. And they see you get in your car and you're driving. They know you're drunk driving. It's like, Leo, this person going to run into your car and say that you hit them. And then when the cops get there, they're going to say, do a, do a um, alcohol um, breathalyzer on Leo. But Leo, this person set you up. It's like, Leo, yeah, you was wrong. You're not supposed to drink and drive. But somebody is setting something up. So, Leo, I don't know. You probably could be a judge. And it's like, Leo, be careful. Because it's like people watching you. Or if you go to this bar or something, um, whoever is per who, whoever the bartender is, they might make something public like judge so-and-so. Judge Leo was just at the bar and he bought 10 drinks and I saw him pull off in his car. He's drinking and driving. Like something might become public or something. Somebody could be a judge. Somebody trying to set a judge up or something. But it's like, Leo, don't let these people blackmail you. Mm-mm. Something like that going on. Let me move on. Leo, your, your self-care is success. Spirit wants you to know that something is going to be successful. If this is like a trial or like some type of conviction, you go to jail. Leo, something that you might get found innocent. Somebody could be making you feel as though you gon' you you guilty or they got evidence on you and they don't or something like that. Mmm. No, they didn't. Yeah, somebody um could be watching you, Leo, and you could be like um in your town or in your state. You're very popular, well known, Leo. I don't know if you could be a politician. It's like somebody watching you. And you could be at a bar. And this person is watching you. And they might hit your car on purpose. And say you hit their car. Or something like that. Because this person knew that you was drinking. Or something. Something is a setup. So Leo be careful. Alright. <laughs> or Leo you might get karma. For something you doing. All right, give me a message for Leo. Yeah, desert passage. Trust there's a divine plan. Yeah, Leo, something going on the first half of August. Leo, it say desert passage. Trust there's a divine plan. So, Leo, something going on with you the first half of August. And Spirit wants you to trust there's a reason for this. There's a reason for this, Leo. So I'm hearing that Drake song, God's Plan. I'm hearing that song, God's Plan. Desert Passage. So something might dry up. Um, 
Leo, this could be your finances. Somebody might try to get you fired or... It's a desert. It's hot. People could be applying pressure to your life, Leo. Somebody trying to blackmail you. A desert passage. But Leo, I just heard the key word is it's a passage. So you just got to walk through it and get over it. Get, get through it. A dry land. Yeah. So this could be like a false arrest. People gang stalking you or something. Trying to put you in a situation. Or Leo, if you're getting karma, it's like going to be quick. Like this is not going to go on forever. So Leo, say like for, say like for an example, Leo, you lied on somebody. Leo, the first half of August, somebody going to lie on you. But it's like spirit is going to allow you to be put under pressure, but you're going to be like the clear innocent. But Leo, you're going to have to go through the same thing that you put somebody else through. Yeah, something like that. I'm picking up two for some of y'all. Y'all getting a little bit of karma. But it's going to be very quick. It's not going to be nothing drawn out and something like that. Yeah, but some of y'all, y'all getting a little bit of karma. Yeah, so. For the for the readings, the, uh, the monthly readings. Um, I'm only pulling two tarot cards. Um. Because I got to try to keep, uh, because I talk a lot. And sometimes it takes me a long time to do my readings. Because, you know, I talk a lot. So, I got to um, keep the, the monthly readings to a minimum as much as possible. So, what's going on with Leo? What can Leo expect? Okay, we had an empress. So, Leo, you could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus. Or you can have Libra or Taurus in your chart. This empress, I don't know, Leo, if this is you. But this is feminine energy. Leo, if you a man, it could be some women fighting over you. And um, Leo, somebody trying to get you caught up. So Leo, say like you a politician or you 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 um you're very well known in your town or something. And Leo, you could have had a mistress. It's like, Leo, your, mist your mistress is going to be following you and she's trying to get you in trouble because you chose your main female and not her. Yeah, Leo, somebody trying to get you in trouble. Somebody trying to blackmail you because of this empress. Or, Le Leo, you could be this empress. Or, Leo, somebody mad because you're pregnant. Or, Leo, somebody mad because you got somebody else pregnant or something like that. Yeah, with the two of swords came out. So, Leo, you can have air in your chart. Are you dealing with an air sign? Uh, a Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. So, we definitely got Libra out here. The Empress and the two of swords. So, Leo, you can have Libra in your chart. Are you definitely did a, dealing with a Libra? Leo? <laughs> The Empress, is this Leo? The Empress, is this? Huh, yeah. So, Leo, you could definitely have Libra in your chart. <laughs> Leo, whether you are male or female, you got you might get caught cheating. Um, Or your third party could be trying to bribe you. Leo, again, whether you a male or a female, you might get caught cheating. Leo, somebody could be saying you don't know who your child's father is. Your child's mother don't know if you the father. Um, or Leo, some money might get blocked. Something might get blocked. So, Leo, I don't know if somebody might freeze your bank accounts or something like that. The Empress with the Two of Swords. Or, or Leo, you didn't know. Somebody could have tried to trick you. It's like you the Empress. It's like, Leo, somebody took advantage of your authority or your position. Leo, this could also be like your lover or your child doing this to you. 
or like a, a, a co-worker or something, somebody you trusted and you didn't know something about them. So Leo, just kind of be careful and be as honest as you can. So Leo, this could be a situation where you could be in a car with somebody. Um, I'm going to give this for example. Leo, say like one of your male friends call you and say, Leo, bring me to such and such. It's like, Leo, you bring the, your lover to this place and your lover do harm to somebody. He robbed the place or he shoot somebody. It's like, Leo, somebody used you to do something and you might get caught up in the middle of it, but you innocent. Leo, you didn't do something on purpose or you didn't know this person's intentions. Leo, you didn't know. That's why you, and it could have been because you was drinking. Or Leo, you could have made a bad choice in the past. Leo, I don't know if you could have chose your, your karmic over your twin. And you might get karma for that, for making a bad decision in the past. Or Leo, because of like somebody you connected to, they going to get you in trouble or something like that, Leo. But just be careful. Or somebody didn't tell you the whole story. Something could have been like a scam or something like that. And then we got five of cups at the bottom of the deck. Yeah. Um, Leo, you the empress. So you, you somebody's wife, child, mother. Somebody's mother. You could be pregnant. You could be dealing with your child's father. You could be a business owner. But Leo, it's something you don't know. Leo, I'm hearing somebody put you in your shadow side. So, Leo, I don't know. Somebody might slip you, or slip you a Mickey. Or, Leo, somebody got you high and drunk and had you sign documents when you was out your mind. Something like that going on. Or, Leo, you did this on purpose and, and you, you could be getting karma. But, Leo, I'm kind of picking up. If you innocent... You're going to get justice. You're going, you're going to get, um, um, the punishment got to fit the crime. So it's like, Leo, if, if the punishment got to fit the crime, that's all I'm saying. So Leo, if you truly was innocent in the matter, you're going to get set free, but your punishment is going to fit your crime. <laughs> but it's something you didn't know. It's like, Leo, you kind of got tricked into something, but you didn't. So, like I said, it's like, Leo, say like what happened, like I gave an example that, Leo, you could be very popular in your hometown and you have somebody watching you. This person is aware that you got in your car, you drinking and driving. So, it's like, Leo, it's like when the police get there, it's like the police know that this person lying on you. But it's like they still got to charge you, Leo, because you still was drinking. So it's like this person wanted you to get charged for um, drinking and driving. And this person wanted you to pay for their damages. And this person wanted to ruin your reputation. So this person wanted to, wanted to kill three birds with one stone. But Leo, everything is not going to go exactly how this karmic wanted it to go. Because if it's not in a situation where, like, Leo, you got caught drinking and driving... But, Leo, this person ran into your car. They did it on purpose. It's like, Leo, this person might ruin your reputation a little bit. But, Leo, you, you don't owe this person when everything, when the smoke clear. Leo, you, you're not going to owe this person no money. Because they're going to find out that this person actually indeed hit your car. Even though you were the one that was drinking. This person still ran into you. And on purpose. So it's like, whatever somebody trying to set you up or do something, Leo, it's not going to go exactly how this person wanted it to go. It's, it's, it's not. All right, what's the spill with the Empress? Yeah, divination spying, Leo, I told you. Leo, somebody's spying on you. 
literally or divination or leo someone astro travels to you and they know your secrets like what you do in secret so leo somebody leo somebody um somebody better be careful because leo you could be doing something in secret but Leo, this person only know because they did divination spying. And it's like, Leo, this person got to prove it because this is divination spying. This is intuition. So it's like, Leo, this person got to prove it. They got to prove it because this person being nosy. So it's like, Leo, this person probably know your secrets, but what they going to do? They can't call the cops. They can't call the cops because they found out this inf information intuitively. And, and the authorities don't too much um, handle intuition and divination spines. This person can't bring this to the police. So, Taurus, you could be doing something you don't got no business doing. But it's like this person got to prove it. And they can't call the cops. Because this person, Leo, you was in the comforts of your own home. And this person went astro traveling, spying on you, and saw something that you were doing... That could have been illegal in the comforts of your own home. Leo, this person could have astro traveled to you and saw you or heard you taking a bribe. But it's like, Leo, this person got to prove this. Because they were doing something they didn't have no business doing as well. So it's like, Leo, you wrong and this other person wrong as well. There's something like that going on. Yeah. What's the spill with the two of swords? Somebody's trying to be slick and something not going to go their way. Yeah, long distance. So, Leo, somebody could have been catfishing you. Leo, you didn't know that something was long distance. Leo, your lover um could have had a, a long distance relationship. Um, or Leo, you didn't know why your lover kept kept something long distance. It could have been because they had another lover. And Leo, you might find that out the first half of just August. So you didn't know something that was long distance. Or this is somebody astro traveling. Long distance. They had to the astro travel to you. Leo, you didn't know a strong emotional commitment to another who is far away and often beyond physical access most of the time. So, Leo, a lover of yours could be cheating on you. They have another lover, but it's long distance. This could be the person that's trying to blackmail you, Leo. Or somebody is astro traveling to you, Leo, and you didn't know. Leo, somebody's trying to taunt you. That's what this is. <clears throat> Leo, whatever you're doing, you're operating from your shadow side. Leo, somebody is using divination to find out your business. And it's like, Leo, I don't know. It's like this person is taunting you, but they really can't do nothing because they found out through divination. I don't know exactly what you're doing, Leo, but this person can't do nothing to you. <laughs> they can't because they're, they're, they're finding out your shadow side through divination. Yeah, so it's like they really, they, Leo, somebody don't got nothing on you. Leo, somebody might literally call like the cops on you because of something they found out intuitively. And Leo, this, the, the authorities on the 3D don't have evidence. So Leo, you might get um set free. Leo, you might go to jail. But they gonna let you go because they don't have evidence, Leo. So what I'm hearing, Leo, is if you get locked up on a 3D, this person going to get locked up on a 5D. Because they committed a crime on a 5D. They're spying. They're astro traveling. Trying to get you in trouble, Leo. So if you get arrested on a 3D, they getting arrested on a 5D. And Leo, for some of y'all, I'm picking up this person could be your lover. And they keep you long distance or they got their other lover is long distance. And Leo, you didn't know. Mm. Leo, you didn't know that a strong emotional commitment. Somebody had a strong emotional commitment to another who is far away. 
and often beyond physical access most of the time. Or Leo, somebody that could be astro traveling maybe to another lover or to you might by accident find out something about you because they're astro traveling. Or Leo, you could be the one that's astral traveling. And that could be your shadow side. Leo, you could be astral traveling. Um, Leo, you could also be astral traveling too. Or Leo, you're doing something. You could be getting a tarot reading done on somebody. And spirit don't want you to do that because that's your shadow side. And Leo, you might find out something that you wish you didn't know. Because you astral traveling or you getting a tarot reading done, Leo. But it's like, Leo, if you the one that's astro traveling or you're getting tarot readings without somebody consent, it's like, Leo, you going to um, find out something that you wish you didn't know. But spirit is telling you to let it go because of how you found out. So it's like, Leo, spirit is telling you your self-care is success. Let that go. You found out. It is what it is. Leo, let it go. Because you shouldn't have been astro traveling. So it's like, Leo, you're going to have to go around and act like you don't know something that you know or something like that. But spirit is telling you to just brush something off. Just let that go. So, Leo, you might find out your lover was cheating on you because you went astral traveling or something like that. So give me a card chart for the Empress and Divination Spine. Yeah, we got rocking horse childhood. Okay. So, Leo, your lover could be um, cheating on you with someone from their childhood. Or, Leo, you've been astro traveling since childhood. Or, Leo, do you be stealing? <laughs> oh... Okay, Leo, I heard if you're pregnant, Leo, you spirit don't want you astro traveling. If you're pregnant, stop astro traveling. Because it might cause you stress. Leo, you might find out your lover could be cheating on you when you're pregnant. But spirit is saying stop. What, don't astro travel while you're pregnant. Or don't do divination spying while you're pregnant. Or, Leo, somebody could be trying to get information about you. Like, who your child's father is, who your child's mother is, who your parents are. Leo, somebody trying to, could be trying to get in your business. Or, Leo, you're trying to be in somebody else's business. About maybe a child or some paternity test or something. Yeah, something to do with somebody's childhood. But your shadow side offering only destructive criticism. Misusing business, legal, or criminal authority. Or Leo, this could be, let me see, let me see if this is you. This judge energy in reverse. Is this Leo? Is this Leo? Yeah, Leo, that is you. So you is operating from your shadow side. And spirit could be telling you to stop. Leo, you could be, I'm also picking up, Leo, you could be a judge or a lawyer. And you could you could be astro traveling yourself or you're paying for tarot readings to like finesse like a case when you should just let it happen naturally. And, um... Leo, you could be doing this because the, the case could be about a child. The case could be about a child. So, Leo, it's like if you're into the occult, this situation is like you taking it personal because there's children involved. Leo, you could be a lawyer or a judge and spirit telling you don't do that. Like, don't take a bribe. Don't get a tarot reader on this case. Um, don't astro project to the, to the offender's house, Leo, if you a lawyer or a judge, don't do that. Spirit is saying, 
Let this happen naturally, Leo. But Leo, you could be taking something personal because it involves children or something. All right, what's the spill with the two or two with the long distance? I mean, give me a charm card for the two of swords and long distance. Yeah, whiskey decompressed. Yeah. <laughs> I'm also picking up two, Leo. If you like um, getting tarot readings on somebody or you astro traveling, it's like, Leo, you still not going to get all the information that you wanted or this other person is not going to get all the information that they wanted. Either way it go, Leo, whether you or this other person, spirit telling you to decompress, like let something go. Just let it go. Leo, you could be taking something personal that you that you don't necessarily have to. And Leo, you could be a lawyer or a judge. And you don't like this, um, this uh, offender. This offender, you don't like this case. You don't appreciate what this person did. So Leo, you're taking it very personal. And you're willing to like almost cause an injustice. It's like you're not giving this offender the, the opportunity for an equal trial. Because of your own personal feelings and emotions about the case. Like something like that is going on. And Spirit is saying, Leo, let that go. Like this is your job. Don't take it personal. Like this is what you do for work. Like don't be extra trying to get somebody convicted or something like that. Just let it happen naturally. Because it's like, Leo, you could be a judge or a lawyer. Whether this offender or this criminal is guilty or innocent, it's like, Leo, it ain't taking no money from your, from your bank account. Your kids is not in danger. Like, this has nothing to do with you, Leo. So Spirit is saying decompress. Don't take that personal. So, Leo, I'm also hearing whatever your line of work is, you're starting to become overwhelmed. Or it's a, it's a specific t case that's like you're taking it very personal because it could involve a child or children. And you personally don't like this offender or this criminal lawyer. I mean, Leo, you personally don't like this person. So you it's like you want to make sure this person get life without parole. You want to make sure this person get the death penalty. You doing it, Leo. But this could be a jury trial. And like, Leo, you the judge. Or <laughs> something like that going on. And Leo, you trying to fix something. That was, and Spirit telling you don't do that, Leo. You operating from your shadow side. Yeah. Or it's like, Leo, you could get nervous. You could be a, the, the defender. Or you're the lawyer. Or you're a judge or something. And Leo, you, you want this person to get um judged so bad that you're willing to do um uh dark magic or divination to make sure the case go your way and leo spirit is saying don't do that don't do it if this person is innocent and i fix it to where this person go free go free let it be leo if if this person is guilty and i fix it to where this person get found guilty leo let it be like something, spirit wants you to just let something be, let something go. Like let something happen naturally. And it it, it, it it won't cause you as much stress, Leo, if you just do something, do do something right, Leo. Something won't be as stressful if you, if you just do the right thing. Take your emotions out of something. Don't take something personal, especially if this is like at work. Because Leo, your self-care, this is success. So it's like, Leo, why are you in your shadow energy and you got all this positive potential around you? That's what I'm trying to understand what's going on. Yeah. So, Leo, you could be trying to get justice for somebody. And Spirit is telling you that's not your place and that's not your position. But if you back off, you'll be able to decompress. Or something like that could be going on. But, Leo, that's what I have for you. Um, let me see something. Because, Leo, out of all the signs that I did so far, I think you the only one that was in your shadow side, Leo. Maybe because it's your birthday. I don't know, Leo. All right. Give me a... What's the spill with Judge coming out from reverse, Leo, in a shadow side? What's the spill with this? The seventh house. 
Oh, Leo, you might also get in your shadow side because you found out your lover was cheating on you, too. That could be why, too. And Leo, spirit is saying, your lover not worth it. They not worth it, Leo. So why um jeopardize your job? Why jeopardize your career, your reputation? Your lover is not worth it because they could have been cheating on you. So, Leo, you could be trying to get your lover's third party, like, fired or something. And spirit telling you don't do that. Or something. Something like that. The seventh house. This situation involves someone's partnerships, marriage, business matters. Could be enemies depending on the situation. Yeah. Yeah, Leo, you could be tempted to do some, um, some type of uh, something. Because somebody could be putting you in a situation. What's the seventh house? Libra, yeah. Leo, somebody a Libra. Or, or, or um, we got triple Libra out here. So, Leo, you can have Libra prominently in your birth chart. Or, Leo, you dealing with a Libra. Like, for real, for real. But, Leo, I think you got Libra in your chart. Yeah, you got Libra in your chart. And Leo, you want you want to balance something out. You want to balance something out. But I think Spirit is telling you to trust him with this situation. Or something like that. Because it's like, Leo, you feel as though you're doing the right thing. But you actually, you're lowering your vibration. And you're operating from your shadow side. But you feel as though you're doing the right thing and spirit is saying, no, you're not. You're operating from your shadow side. So you need to decompress or spirit is trying to show you how the right way to decompress. Or, Le or Leo, be careful because somebody could have put something in your drink or something. Yeah. Or, Leo, somebody could have been trying to decompress at your expense. Leo, somebody could have thought you were childish, you was naive. So, they could have been trying to decompress at your expense. L Libra, somebody, Leo, somebody could have stole money from you to give to, to, to give to their lover that's long distance. Yeah, somebody wanted to decompress at your expense. Or something like that. Give me a charm card for the seventh house. For Leo in their shadow side. Yeah, regeneration. Regener this is my pregnancy card. <clears throat> yeah, Leo, you could be pregnant or you're somebody's mother or you're somebody's wife. This is feminine energy. So, Leo, you could be pregnant by somebody else's partner. Or, Leo, you feel as though somebody shouldn't come up against you because you're pregnant. Or somebody shouldn't treat you a certain type of way because you're pregnant. Or, Leo, it's like you could have got pregnant by an enemy. Like, this person is not your divine masculine. This person is a karmic. Regeneration. This is my card for a pregnancy. This situation involves someone's partnerships. Or Leo, you could be influenced, influenced by a lover. So Leo, this could be a... Leo, I'm going to give an example. Leo, say like you work at a pharmacy. Leo, you could be a pharmacist or you just work at a pharmacy. It's like, Leo, your lover is trying to get you to steal. Like get some um, controlled drugs or... Your lover could be trying to get you to do something to jeopardize your career. Like, something like that is going on. And, Leo, you could be pregnant or something. And, Leo, you could have did something out of desperation. Because you felt as though if you didn't do what this man wanted you to do, that, that he was going to leave you and you pregnant. Something like that. Or, Leo, you committed a crime for this man. You did something for this man. But you might still find out that he cheating on you. So, Leo, I don't know if you might go and tell on this man. 
It's like you're telling on yourself in this man, like your karmic lover. Because, Leo, your karmic lover was trying to play you. So you might tell. I did this, I did that, but it was really my karmic lover. Like, something like that, Leo, you telling on somebody? Or something? Yeah, divine offering. Or it's like, Leo, you didn't find out about this man until... It's like, Leo, you, you wish you didn't get pregnant by this man. And it could be too late to get an abortion. It's like you found out about this man's true intentions. It was too late. So, Leo, you could be upset. Because it's like you pregnant, you can't get rid of the baby. And then you find out this man a karmic. Or something like that going on. Well, Leo, I'm going to end it because, um, like I said, I'm going to post that song in the description box and in the, co the comment section. Um, God's plan. God's plan. So, Leo, something's going to eventually work out in your favor. You just got to get through this passage. It's just a passage, Leo. It's just a passage. This karmic not going to be able to hold you down forever. Um, it's just a hiccup in your plan. That's all it is. And I think this person, this karmic, got you in your shadow energy, um, Leo. Or you did this for a lover because y'all could be married or you thought this, yeah, something like that going on. But let me end it. Um, so this is Blood Queen Tarot. <coughs> Excuse me. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and or share. Um... Yeah, I think I, yeah, I said that. Please don't forget to like, comment, and or share. And Leo, enjoy the first half of August, and thank you.